Hello everybody and welcome your faces back to your one and only favorite crypto jet. Now today we're talking about Chainlink. Excuse my uh, favorites list on the right if you want to take a look. These are the coins that I actively keep my eye on because I believe they're good projects. So maybe you would want to take a quick break and pause the video and write some of these down. Now let's get right into Chainlink. Uh, obviously we all know what this coin is. Basically they provide these oracles for storing data on the blockchain network. It's one of the biggest projects uh, out there when it comes to crypto and recently we've seen uh, something that looks like a bullish uh, continuation pattern now bullish continuation patterns can come in several forms so we can have the classic bull flag right which looks something like this and then a break retest movement upwards we can have somewhat of a bullish pennant which is what kind of what we are seeing right now which is basically forgive the bad drawing but it's like a descending sort of triangle formation right and uh, we have uh, you know different type flags we have a lot of these different uh, patterns and basically what they're all called are bullish continuation patterns now that's exactly what we've seen right here so a strong move upwards then a calm down in the price a nice little triangle formation and especially if you move on to the four hour time frame you can see something beautiful which is a break of the pattern a small retest of this important zone that we can see right here which acted as resistance in the past now is acting as a zone of support right at $30 mark and then another movement uh, upwards now this movement uh, will find some resistance around the $35 mark but after that it's pretty clear air all up until the mid 40s and uh, I have high hopes for Chainlink definitely see it breaking its previous all-time high at some point now another thing that i do see is a emergence of a nice nice support from the 50 period moving average now if we take a look at this chart what can we notice in the past take your drawing tool and look at this one two sorry three so this can be acted as a zone of resistance so basically what we see right here is the 50 period moving average or this orange line acting as a zone of significant support at a lot of times and it lost sort of lost traction right here but recently we've seen the same support forming and what happens every time after the 50 period moving average is struck well as you can see it's a bullish movement now the size of this movement does not really uh, you know it doesn't correlate to each other but it's another good indicator of a bullish movement and that's exactly what we're seeing so I would keep this in my radar. I still believe it's a very nice position to buy in uh, for long-term and short-term investors. And I hope you're all taking advantage of this move. Now, if you like the video, please let me know. Uh, show me some love, like, comment, subscribe, and uh, come back for some more news and uh, analysis on crypto markets. Let me know what you want to see. See you all guys uh, in the next video. Adios.